In this quick tutorial, I'll show you how you can add a post signup questionnaire. This also works on the signup form or any of the other Framer Auth forms. You'll see here I have my signup form, and after the user clicks create an account, and then it asks, How did you hear about this website? I can select something. And then when I click finish, it now redirects me to the home page where I can start engaging with the content. So to do this, I'll just come into my Framer project and you can clone this, remix it below. There will be a remix link. Um, so the first thing you're going to want to do is open up this file because it has this base form, which was created by Joel, the co-founder of Framer Auth, and it's free to use. It can be used in any project. So we'll just copy that and then we'll take our sign up form and I'll just press option command K and turn it into a component real quick. And now I'm going to create a new variant and I'll call this one success. And then you can just paste in that form right here. So basically what we're going to do is we're going to say on success, show this form. So I'll just stylize it. Um, you'll probably need to stylize this to match your existing design, but you can select your framer auth form and then just drag this handle to the new variant. And on success, we want to show this variant. So in here, this is um, a completely separate component from Framer Auth, and it'll need to be configured a little bit differently. But for this example, you can just come into the inputs and you'll see here there's options. And I've just added in the different options for my website. So this is all configurable. And then once you've configured that as you'd like, um, you can use a couple different providers, but for this example, I'll be using FormSpark and they give you 250 submissions for free. So I'll create my first form. How did you hear about us? And then create form. Once my form has been created, I just need to come over here, click on how to, and then copy this link right here. And then if I come back into Framer, that base form, I can paste that in here and the rest should be post JSON. You can leave that all the same. The redirect, you'll probably want to send users somewhere after they submit this. So I'll just send them back to my homepage. And then that pretty much completes the entire configuration.